Hello and welcome back to Lord Fit Gaming Plays Borderlands 3. I'm your host, Lord Fan. Today's Borderlands 3 walkthrough video. We're doing Ratched Up Side Mission that we got from the last video. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more Borderlands videos like this. And do not forget to hit the notification bell you update on my Borderlands content and more. So, in the last video, we defeated Kagawa. Got this side mission. I figured, you know what? Let's do this side mission before we do uh, Beneath the uh, Meridian part two since that's gonna be a very long video so first thing you want to do is actually find Terry now great news is when you uh, be in Kaogawa basically Maliwan forces are non-existent here so that's like a nice bonus really nice bonus that's why I like Promethea which is really nice uh, planet overall I'll probably say it's a tie between uh, Promethea and Pandora now I'm currently uh, on the uh, third planet e I mean Eden 6 I should say actually and I don't count uh, Athenus because that's more like a hub. But still, I hadn't placed judgment on that planet yet. But still, this is like a nice uh, area too. I mean, I really love it though. I mean, it's like uh, clean. It's very nice and good. I'm going to try to find the way to uh, Terry. So, why am I uh, going towards the uh, mission marker? Let me explain some uh, a little bit lore about Atlas. Now Atlas was in the first game. They're predominant in the game. They're your enemies for the most part. Yeah, just trust me. They're your enemies and you gotta fight them. And there are like two uh, characters. I'm not gonna spoil who, but they're considered a downfall of the original Atlas. And then uh, in Borderlands 2, they got chased off of Pandora between events of 1 and 2. Now, after uh, 2's events, Reese uh, bought the company. I'm guessing. Kind of wish Fiona would, and none of this would have happened, but oh well. We're almost uh, there, so we're uh, back where we almost uh, started, which is uh, good. And there's no combat, which is even uh, better. So I'm going to go over here and keep on going. Now, this uh, side quest has a lot of action and tons of dialogue. Definitely not going to spoil the dialogue because some of it's uh, not bad at all. So I'm going to go over here and then I'm going to check out what's going on. Oh boy, Terry really lives like an animal. Uh, look around. Maybe he left like a day planner or something. Not that he really seems like a day planner kind of guy. There's got to be a clue in there somewhere. Maybe look behind stuff? I know I always hide clues to my location behind random stuff. It's a nervous habit. A secret door? Terry's a janitor. What secrets does he need to keep? Ah, whoa, well, don't, don't answer that. Every possible answer is gross. Oh, that's one of the old Skunk Works labs. Yeah, I shut it down after all the accidents. I said that all spooky, but it was just a lot of paper cuts. Prometheus' healthcare system is a nightmare. It was just cheaper to shut down the lab. I'm, I'm nervous about paper cuts now. Keep looking around while I go find my little rubber finger guards. I gotta save my friend, he's sick! I know I'm just a janitor, but I gotta do something! I saw an ad on the Econet for online courses in advanced surgery and neuroscience. 100% guaranteed degree at 10% the price! That could work! I mean, you can't put something on the Econet if it's not true, right? Terry? Terry, is that you? Hello? Terry? Is it safe? Who are you? You are Terry? Where is he? What have you done to Terry? He's supposed to let me out when it's safe. Are you a captive against your will? What? No, 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 no. He locked me in here to keep me safe from the others. He was going to let me out once the coast was clear, but it's been a while. Man, I hope he's okay. Could you get me out of here? The door controls are on the other side of that glass. Yeah, right there. That's the door control. So, I'm going to tell everybody what's going down really uh, quick. There's a bunch of ratchets to kill, and we're at to find Terry. There's a bunch of dialogue and ratchets. I'll return when it's clear. To the bloodletting!
but now they're saying I need specimens to do tests on. Where the heck am I gonna get brain samples from? Those ratchets are murder crazy! You gotta kill them before I come out! <laughs> We have to take care of business against the ratches. There's gonna be a whole bunch more. Still, we're gonna to go to the uh, office to open up the uh, cell here. Yeah, we gotta do it. We still have to find Terry. I'm gonna be honest. This um, side mission here is really fun. Good amount of experience points. And I'm gonna say this before. I'm always gonna repeat this until I'm dead. Do many side missions as you can in this game. It gets you rewards. It gets you. Uh, let's see what else. Money and most importantly experience points because you need experience in order to level yeah this is all applies for not just a uh, borderland series it applies to all games jrpgs rpgs anything with an experience bar yeah so i'm gonna go up here and then resume the side quest oh man it feels so good to be out of there come say hi <laughs> I am confused. You are a ratch? Yup! Thanks to my main man, Terry, he saved my life! Come on, we gotta find him! <laughs> ah, no! Terry! They got him! One moment. Please explain just your whole deal. Terry was my best bud. When my human body got sick, he vowed to save me. He took some Echonet courses and found this lab, and pretty soon he figured out how to transfer human brains to rat bodies. All these other ratches here are escape failed experiments. Terry had to test the brain transfer process before he tried it on me, so he used bandits and captured Malawan soldiers. Quick, our only chance to save Terry is to get his brain into a rat body. I'll chew it out. Would it not be simpler? Uh no, the feast has already begun. Now grab his brain so we can bring him back to life! Great, the brain transfer tank is downstairs. Ah, but Gary's cage is in the way. Hey, Gary! Ah, ah 
I'm gonna eat your face! I'll wear your mom skin as a kimono! I'll feed your kids to you! <laughs> Classic Gary. Mallow on war criminal. Honestly, I think he ate people before he got ratched up. Flip that switch to drop his cage so we can get to the transfer tank. <laughs> I'll guzzle your soul milk! I'll break your toenails! I'll spoon feed you your own tongue! I got something from Torque. Well, then again, I've been using a whole bunch of Torque weapons. Yeah, seriously, I've been using so many Torque weapons in this game. Yeah, Torque has some wonderful weapons. They're all explosive damage, but still the impact and the radius is nice. For those of you who can't aim at all. So now, next step is we're going to have to place Terry's brain, and then most likely that'll be done the uh, side mission, but I'm going to give everybody like a nice bonus for uh, completing it. I'm just going to look around real quick before I actually uh, do anything else, because you may never know. And I think I was supposed to go down here. Yep, I was supposed to go exactly down here. Looks like I have to go down here further. Oops, I forgot to do it, but oh well. Yeah, door has opened. Duh. Should have went through it, but you know what? Forget about it. I messed up, but we're going to get it done. And that'll be it for the side uh, mission for this uh, video. Yeah, this is a short one today. And it's a rarity for my Borderlands video, but you know what? Sometimes it's good to have short videos. All right, there's already a fresh rash body in there. I don't know how Terry gets the rash brain out, but I did see him sharpening an ice cream scoop the other day. I will now merge man and beast with the press of a button. to do some CEO stuff and look the other way. We found that cool Atlas weapon prototype when we moved into the lab, but it only works with, you know, hands and stuff. So enjoy! All right, day 32 of neurotransfer trials. Had a lot of misfires, but that's how you improve, right? Containment on the invalid specimens has proven tricky, but that's the great thing about abandoned labs. There's always cages. As long as we don't lose power, they'll stay put. But this is a corporate headquarters. No way are we losing power. You did it! You brought me back! Hell yeah, man! I wasn't gonna leave you dead on the floor. Oh, right. I Kinda ate your body, man. Sorry. No, no, I totally get it. I could actually super go for a human body right now. 
Ratch pals for life, man! Ratch pals for life! So, let me give a review of what went down today. We did Ratched Up. We uh, freed Terry's friend. We transferred Terry's brain to a Ratch. Now we have two Ratches, and Dog Log was pretty hilarious. And we almost got ourselves level uh, 22. Now, in our next video, we're doing Beneath the Meridian Part 2. We're going to finish that uh, story mission up. Well, that's it for today's Borderlands 3 walkthrough on Ratched Up Side Mission. This is Lord Fenton signing off. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day or night.